Let's see how to share a ring camera with family member or friends. As you can see here, I have two devices. Let's say this is the inviter and this is the invitee. And I'm going to share the cameras that I have here. As you can see, I have a front door camera. That's a ring peephole camera. And that's the ring video doorbell that I have just right here. I'm gonna do step by step so you can see how it works. Basically the invitee need, needs a device like an iPad or an iPhone, for example. Here is the Ring app. I already have here installed in the invitee device. And I also can check email here to see the invite, right? So I need to receive an invite. So I need to check email here. So let's just come here and you just click here on the left side and select settings. There we go. You just come down and look for user and pets. That's the new menu on the Ring app. And here I'm the owner of this camera or the video doorbells. And I'm going to add another user here. It's a shared user. So just click here, shared user. And enter the email and the device that you want to share. Let's say, for example, I want to share the front door. Then I just click here and I grant access. So basically I'm sharing the video doorbell, the peephole that I have just right there on my front door. And I need to send an invite to somebody. So I need to insert the email here. Let me just put the email here. There we go. I have an email here for the invitee. And then I just need to click here, send invite. Invite sent. Okay. So I have information here for the shared users. And here I need to check the email now and create also an account. I don't have an account yet. Okay, I'm doing here step by step. So basically I just need to come here to the email. And here I got an email from Ring. So I just click here and I check the email here, right? So that says that I'm invited to the shared device. And here there's the information that I, what I have to do. So basically I need to create a ring free account and I need to get into the account and accept the invitation. Okay. So there's a button here to create an account. If I click here, it's going to direct me to the ring website. So I'm going to search here the information. Let me just put it here. First name, last name and all the information. There we go. I insert all my information here and also I need to create a password. Okay. So I just create an account and I see here that's a crown that is created. Okay. So pretty easy like this. Now I need to log into my account. So if I just come here to the link app, I cl click here, sign in because I already created an account. Then I need to insert my email here to log in. Okay, so I just log in with my account and then I got a verification code to insert the verification code. I just did that, right? I get a verification code on my email, okay? The invitee email. And then I get into the screen after the, log, the, after the login. So I need to send a verification email again. Let me just check my email again. There we go. Then I get this email from Ring saying to verify now. I'm just basically verifying the account for the invitee, right? It's the first time that I'm creating an account here. So I click verify now and I get this message. Thank you. Okay. Go to my dashboard, continue and continue again. Now I need to log in again with my account. So basically here is via web browser or I can do via the software there. Let me just come back to the software to see if it's better there. There we go. Okay, and here I already have the information that I need, I can enable the ring skill here with the Alexa. I'm gonna skip this for now and continue, right? Continue again. There we go. So what type of location is this? I'm going to say that's home. Hit here, continue. And use the current location as my address. So I'm going to use to allow the app to get my address. There we go. Have information. It's correct here. And use this address. So 
I'm done. Everything is good now. Okay, after the verification steps, you just need to come here to your account and then you come to this menu and choose Control Center. Okay, so the verification steps, it's on you, right? You need to do all of verification steps with the cell phone, with emails, whatever. Ring asks you to verify your account so you can get to the screen, right? Then you come to this menu and Control Center. There you go. And here you select shared users and you're gonna see the invitation just right here, it's pending. You click on manage and accept. See, this location is shared. This is important because when you come back here to the main screen, here you come to the dashboard and then you're gonna see the address here, okay? So if you have a different address here, you need just to click here and click on shared. There you're gonna find the camera that's shared, all right? Just click here. There you go, camera preview. There you go. So it's working basically with my camera, with the people that I just shared, right? And guys, it's easy like this, okay? You just need to take extra step and be patient to set up your account here. When you set up an, as an invitee with the new account, you need to do all the verification the ring asks you to do, receiving like a code and entering the code and things like that, right? But the important part later is just to select the correct location here in the menu so you can see the shared camera. And you also need to accept the invitation as I just showed you here, right? So I hope you can share your camera with your, with your family and members. So that's the way you do it, right? Please just give your thumbs up and subscribe to this channel. I see you in the next one.